Welcome to the DMNVX AV over IP residential, now in next session. In this session, Andrew Lutke will highlight the performance and flexibility of Crestron's DMNVX AV over IP solution for living spaces, which ensure seamless, high quality entertainment experiences for your clients, not to mention some solid social distancing possibilities. Then, Alex Paris will demonstrate the latest advancements in DMNVX, followed by a look at some exciting innovations on the horizon. Lastly, you'll have an opportunity to have all of your questions answered in real time by Crestron Technical Advisors. Here's a solution. Let's get this session started. While there's rapid innovation and progress happening with AV over IP, one might say that Crestron's DMNVX solution has become the de facto industry standard with more units installed than many competitors combined. In just three short years, NVX has changed a lot. And I think it's important to highlight that this is possible because NVX is ultimately flexible. At the core of NVX is an FPGA, a field programmable gate array, which is really just a reprogrammable chip. This enabled us to evolve, adapt, and upgrade NVX. And NVX has evolved as the industry and market has changed, as evidenced by the 75 major feature updates we have released since 2018. Even for projects deployed two years ago, NVX is better today than the day it was installed. How often can you say that about a product? For NVX, it's absolutely true due to free firmware updates. The image quality is better with pixel-perfect processing. The switching time is reduced. And the NVX products support new features that solve new design needs. And NVX now supports standards like AES67 that further extend interoperability. All of this ensures relevance as technologies continues to evolve. NVX adapts as needs change and content is released in new formats. This provides investment protection and future proofing. And since NVX offers this ultimate level of flexibility, we will be able to deploy NVX in new ways and integrate it into new platforms to support new applications. But before we go there, let's take a look at NVX now. DMNVX is an ecosystem of products built to work as one, with price performance optimized solutions perfect for residential applications. When you simply need to transport a cable box, Apple TV, or streaming player, the DMNVX E30 can be used to deliver the solution. To decode, use the DMNVX D30, or any of the scaling devices like the DMNVX 350, 351, and 352. The 350 series also enables the ability to transport flexible USB 2.0 data to extend a gaming console like Xbox or PlayStation 4. We also have options to downmix compressed audio, so any audio format can be heard in the house. DMNVX is built to solve all of your needs. The next generation of DMNVX, the DMNVX 360 series, is built upon the DMNVX platform, delivering functionality and features requested by our customers to provide the best possible AV over IP experience. The new DMNVX 360 and 363 products are all-in-one encoders or scaling decoders with new features like PoE Plus for simplified installation and design, HDR10 Plus and Dolby Vision to support the latest consumer video formats in Apple TVs, a sleeker form factor with the ability to disable the fan when not in use for bedroom or quiet spaces, and continued support for USB 2.0 to extend gaming consoles or even crush on home time. In addition, the DMNVX 363 provides both audio downmix and Dante support on the same products, enabling the flexibility for audio transport on the network. All products come in both card and box form factors. These new products are fully interoperable with the entire DMNVX ecosystem. By using DMNVX, you can design, install, manage, and build the best AV over IP standards-based system on any residential network. The DMNVX 360 series is an all-in-one encoder or decoder with the following features. A four-port Ethernet switch that can be used with either copper or fiber. In addition, it has an audio port that's dedicated to separate audio traffic on your network. So you can stream out AES67 or Dante audio from this port if you wish, or you can just use either the single copper port or the other fiber port. Since it's an encoder or decoder, in encoder mode, you can take the HDMI input and stream it out on the network, as well as see the video on the local HDMI loop out. In decoder mode, it can take any of the DMNVX streams that are on the network or the local HDMI input video and output. 
Both of these HDMI ports support CEC. The analog audio port can be set to insert or extract, so you can configure it how you want it for your application. And lastly, we support full USB 2.0 routing. With the separation of host and HID ports, you can now trigger off a of short keys so you can route for KVM applications. And on the back side, we still have our control options with COM and IR to control any displays. The DMNVX can be mounted behind the display, underneath the table, or by using the card form factor in a rack. The DMNVX family solves all of your needs. Built around industry standards, Crestron solutions are designed to bring a peace of mind to system designers and installers. The DMNVX family of products, including the new DMNVX 360 series, support industry standards for audio, security, network integration, HDMI, and HTCP to provide a flexible AV over IP solution. Let's take HDR10 Plus and Dolby Vision, which are new features now available on the DMNVX 360 and DMNVX 363. These features allow residential designers to route HDR10 Plus or Dolby Vision content alongside of any HDR or non-HDR source in the system, providing the best video experience for the homeowner. In the demo here, we have a DMNVX E30 and the new DMNVX360 configured as transmitters. The DMNVX E30 is connected to a Kaleidoscape, while the 360 is connected to an Apple TV. To receive the stream and display the video, we have a DMNVX363 and a DMNVX360. Both are configured as receivers and they're connected directly to the displays. All of the devices are connected to a standard one gigabit network switch and are receiving PoE+, allowing a single wire to power the solution. DMNVX is controllable with Crestron Home and Crestron 3 Series and 4 Series processors, allowing simple configuration, setup, and control of any residential system. Because of our support for HDR10+, Dolby Vision, non-HDR, and interlaced content, residential customers can easily switch between any of the available sources from any of the control interfaces. As you can see here, we'll simply switch to the Apple TV and now show Dolby Vision content which was previously showing non-HDR content before. With the new DMNVX360 series, the DMNVX family continues to grow and get better. A great example of the flexibility of NVX is a new feature we will be introducing later this year. Through a free firmware update, we will provide the ability to display video preview on your touch panel screen, web browser, or in almost any application through the NVX API. A common UI design will be to add a thumbnail view of the video to the source select button, making it easy for users to quickly identify and select a source they want to route. This is just one more example of how we continue to extend the capabilities and bring new value to NVX solutions already deployed while offering new options for future system designs. I think it will come as no surprise when I say that it's not uncommon for hardware-based solutions to over time be replaced by or augmented by more flexible software-based solutions. A great example of this is what has been happening in the new UC space, where dedicated hardware-based codecs are quickly being replaced by more flexible software and cloud-based applications from Zoom and Microsoft. As I've described, NVX is really software, and so we'll be able to showcase new software-based implementations of NVX that will extend the use cases the types of applications, and the ways NVX can be implemented. Since software is flexible and portable, it can be recompiled to run on different platforms. And so we'll be demonstrating NVX encoding and decoding applications deployed on standard x86 hardware running Microsoft Windows or Linux operating systems. It can be compiled for CPU and GPU applications. This is going to open up a lot of new possibilities for things like software-based transcoding solutions that further extend interoperability, or consider software solutions that enable windowing or multi-view applications, or perhaps NVX decoding applications that will run on your lecture capture system, enabling video to be consumed right off the network without the added complexity of additional hardware. The options are limitless, so we see this as a really important part of what's next for NVX. You will also start to see new models of NVX that are price performance optimized. So you can choose the product that best meets the design criteria while also remaining within budget. Not every solution requires the latest and highest resolution video standards. Cable boxes, for example, are typically 4K30, and most UC codecs only support 1080p. We will be bringing to market NVX solutions that support the capabilities you need without burdening them with anything you don't. 
They will be 100% NVX, so they'll be fully compatible with the NVX ecosystem, enabling designers to mix and match products that are price performance optimized for each source, destination, and application. Everything you need, nothing you don't, at a price that makes NVX an easy decision. I also want to take a moment to talk about investment protection. With NVX, we are offering upgrade options and migration strategies. We're building bridges and enabling hybrid ecosystems and planned technology migrations without the need to rip and replace. With millions of DM products deployed worldwide, we offer our customers the ability to continue to leverage those investments while still being able to take advantage of all the benefits of AV over IP through hybrid ecosystems and bridging technologies. We also know that HD Base T will be around for a long time. It's still the preferred solution for in-room switching. And that's why we continue to invest in HD Base T. With products like the forthcoming DM NVX E760, these in-room switching solutions can be tied into a larger ecosystem, taking advantage of the things that AV over IP does so well, such as scale, enable global sources, and room overflow capability. Finally, there's 8K. While widespread adoption is still a little ways away, we know that more and more designers will be looking for ways to move 8K content around. Working with our partners, we have showcased 8K scaling solutions built around the same Intel ARIA 10 FPGA on which NVX runs today. And it's also easy to do the math. If NVX is able to deliver flawless, low latency video over a one gig network, we will deliver 8K over new multi-gig technology that supports two and a half and five gig on the same Cat5 infrastructure that is already installed and widely used today. With new multi-gig switches and NICs on the market, that path to 8K over IP is clear, and it still doesn't require a 10 gigabit link or expensive new cabling. So it will remain scalable and flexible and provide an easy migration avenue. With all of this, the future is super exciting.